Hello guys, welcome back to another video of me, Superstar7, and today my friends we have some more Terraria news. This comes in the form of the state of the game for October. This dropped a few days ago. I'm a little late to the party, but there's not a lot going on inside of this state of the game. But something really awesome is mentioned in it, which I think is worthy of its own video. I previously made a prediction for what's to come in the future of Terraria after 1.4.4. In my previous video, we went as far as talking about Terraria. Terraria 1.5. We predicted that a new boss could be added to the game and we also predicted one of the features crossplay. I'm pretty sure by this point that almost everybody within the Terraria community knows exactly what cross-platform play would bring to Terraria. But let's go over it anyway. Imagine a world where all Terrarians could play on any version together with no service restrictions. That has been the goal of getting to parity. Parity is about getting on the same version on all versions of Terraria across each platform. Both Relogic and Doctor Studios have both said that once we reach parity, they would be working on cross-platform. Outside of the PC version, Doctor Studios currently program and develop each and every version of Terraria for each other platform other than PC. Now for those of you who are saying, hey on, this is the last update, this is the end, let me shut you down now. Red once said that Terraria 1.2.2 would be the last update. He then hinted that 1.3 was the last update, and then 1.4, and now 1.4.4. So no matter what happens, this isn't the final update, because ReLogic have already stated that they want to have cross-platform play. And for this to happen, you would have to update the game, meaning that it would go from 1.4.4 to 1.4.5 or vice versa wherever else it would go. Now that we've taken care of those who are unsure, let's get back to this as we know that there is going to be a further update. Inside of this state of the game, Doctor Studios had this to say. The team at Doctor Studios is working hard to keep pace with the PC fixes, while also working on some console and mobile specific bug fixes. 1.4.4.1 should already be in the hands of everyone and we are happy to share that 1.4.4.5 is live for iOS and Android as of this morning which obviously this was a few days ago. They also said this. Beyond that update, we will be looking to continue with fixes until we reach the same final version as PC. And then in quotation marks, they put whatever that turns out to be, ha ha ha. And we feel like we are in a good place with fixes on console and mobile. And on top of this, we are already in the planning stages for our attempt at crossplay. The team has a good sense for where we currently stand, as well as the potential issues that lie ahead. We will share more details of our plan once we have it a bit more fleshed out. Until next time console and mobile friends, thanks for all your love and support. So there you go. Doctor Studios themselves have said that crossplay is going to be coming. And for this to come, PC is going to need to get an update alongside console, mobile, Android, iOS. And that is pretty much it for today's state of the game for October. I will leave a link down in the description for the October state of the game as there is other things to read. But most of it is just talking about how awesome the release for 1.4.4 was. Also, before we go, Tmod Loader are still working on Terraria Tmod 1.4.4. They don't know when they're going to have it ready. They have said they don't want to rush Terraria Tmod 1.4.4 as it would leave a lot of mods in the dust. And they want to give the modding community a chance to update their mods so that everybody can enjoy them in Terraria 1.4.4. Anyways guys, I've been Social7, you've been absolutely awesome and I shall see you guys in my next video. If you haven't already, don't forget to turn on the post notifications and I shall see you guys in my next video. Goodbye.